Education Cabinet Secretary Professor George Magoha alongside other stakeholders including the Teacher Service Commission were at the Kenya Institute of Curriculum Development to launch the National Curriculum Policy. The new policy will guide implementation of the new system of education and addresses five key areas crucial to the process including access to quality and relevant education, assessment, resource mobilization and management. The policy gives direction to the implementation of the relevant competency-based curriculum which will ensure that all learners acquire competencies and qualifications capable of promoting national values, inspiring individual uh, innovation and lifelong learning. Over 91,000 teachers have so far been trained on how to roll out the competence-based curriculum. According to the Cabinet Secretary, the government will pull all stops to actualize the new syllabus despite opposition from some stakeholders such as the Kenya National Union of Teachers who were conspicuously missing at the launch. It's not going back on the process of the implementation of the competency-based curriculum. The rollout shall continue in a most well-organized, systematic, and highly professional manner to ensure that our children get quality education for a better future. In a letter to Professor Magoha dated May 14, 2019, NAD Secretary General Wilson Sosion said they had decided not to participate in the exercise, saying it is flawed, lacks legitimacy, and public participation as required by the Constitution.